In today's video, I'll be showing you how to create a Windows 11 bootable USB using the media creation tool. This will allow you to create a bootable USB or DVD so you can install a clean copy of Windows 11 or reinstall it if you already have it installed on either your computer or another computer. So it's always handy having a bootable Windows 11 USB or DVD. But before we get started, if you haven't already subscribed to our YouTube channel and you want to see more Windows 11 tutorials, then be sure to click on that subscribe button as we will be doing a lot more Windows 11 tutorials. So the first thing you need to do is go ahead and click on the link that's in the description below and you will end up on a page that looks like this. You now need to scroll down until you come across Create Windows 11 Installation Media. But before you begin, go ahead and expand this section here and then just read through it and just ensure the computer you are going to install Windows 11 onto does actually support Windows 11, otherwise you will not be able to install it. But if you're using this USB just to reinstall Windows 11, then you will already know that your computer obviously supports Windows 11. So the next thing we need to do is select Download Now and you then need to go save file. Once the file's finished downloading, we then need to run the file. You will then end up with a window saying getting a few things ready. You will now end up with a window that looks like this. As you can see, this is to select my language and edition of Windows. So I'm going to use my recommended options for this PC as I want to upgrade this computer to Windows 11. However, if you're going to be upgrading or installing Windows 11 onto another computer, then you might want to change the language or edition. So you can simply do this by deselecting this option and then selecting the drop downs. So once you're happy with your options, go ahead and select next. So we now need to find a USB that is at least eight gig. So I already have a USB plugged into my computer once you have plugged your USB stick into your machine, you then need to ensure you have nothing on it. As you can see, my USB is completely empty, but if you do have any data on the USB, go ahead and take those files off because as soon as you select your USB and then run this media creation, it will completely remove those files. And if you're gonna be using an ISO file, creating a DVD version, then you would select the ISO file option. So I'm gonna go ahead and go next, since I have my USB already plugged in. And as you can see, it's come up in the list. If yours isn't listing, go ahead and select refresh drive list, and then select your USB. We now need to go ahead and press next, and it will now begin to prepare your bootable Windows 11 USB. So depending on how fast your computer and internet is, will depend on how long this will take. And also it does depend on how good your USB stick is as well. Once the media creation tool has finished creating your Windows 11 bootable USB, you will have a window saying that your flash drive is ready. So there you go. That is how you create a bootable Windows 11 USB using the media creation tool. I hope this tutorial helped you out and you enjoyed it. If it did, smash the like button below and subscribe for more computer sluggish tutorials.